Hey everybody, what's going on? Speedy Diver here, and I want to let you guys know that I have a new Instagram, link in the description. Also, my Twitter is down there as well, and this is night 504 of GameStop Dumbstruck sure Diving, and yeah, there's a skateboard. This thing is freaking awesome. There's also like wrapping paper, I think it is. I really didn't look at it yet, because I love the surprise, even though I just found it, like, I, I don't know, it's just, it's freaking awesome. There's a Tony Hawk skateboard, and yes, I've actually found one of these before. Very, very long time ago, I found one of these. It's a Tony Hawk birdhouse, uh, like balance skateboard kind of thing. It's actually for the Wii. I looked at it before because obviously I was so excited when I found it. Uh, yeah, it's for the Wii. To be honest, I had no idea they actually made this for the Wii. This is freaking dope. I don't know if it turns on. I haven't tried it yet, but it's so cool. I'm like freaking out right now. But before I actually get into the video, I want to thank you guys so much for all the love and support. We are getting to 1 million subscribers. Make sure you subscribe right now because we are getting so, so close to 1 million. It's like 900 and like 11,000 subscribers. You guys are the best. I'm freaking out tonight. Let's get into this. So the skateboard, let's see if it works. Let's see. Also, I ended up going to the regular GameStop I usually go to, which is uh, where I got this bag this stuff as well. The other GameStop that I went to last night, I believe, uh, this actually got that bag because it's one of the weird looking bags, so it's different. So uh, I did really good at that GameStop last night. Got a PS4 game. Watch the video right here. It was freaking awesome. But uh, that's why I went again tonight because I did so good last night. So let's check this out. Does it work? Does it turn on? I don't think it's turning on. That's definitely the power button. Let's press all the buttons. Press all the buttons. Yeah, it's definitely not turning on. Also, it doesn't have the Velcro on the back, which most of these skateboards usually do, because uh, I think it makes you, like, like actually, it lets, it's easier for you to, like, balance or something for, like, carpeting. I think that's what it's for. There's, like, it's supposed to be, like, Velcro strips or something like that. But uh, either way, still freaking awesome. I have no idea what this yellow thing is. Is that candy? I think it's a piece of candy. It probably ended up falling out of one of these bags. I have no idea. But uh, this thing is so cool. It's got the sensors on the front. This is definitely like, I love these skateboards. I think they are the coolest thing. I used to skateboard when I was younger, so uh, it's definitely really cool. I don't think I can skateboard anymore. Uh, I can longboard, I can do that. But uh, it's way easier. That is freaking awesome. That is so cool. So that is the first find tonight. Next we have this, which I think it's Star Wars wrapping paper, if I'm not mistaken. It's already opened, as you can see. Uh, five bucks apparently StarWars.com Yeah, it's Star Wars 30 square feet of <laughs> Star Wars wrapping paper I just, I don't know why I find that funny oh, It was on clearance for two dollars Oh, two ninety seven, so three bucks basically Damn It is seriously brand new It is brand new, it's already been opened But it's got the cellophane on it This is an awesome find I mean, obviously can't use it right now Because this is Christmas wrapping paper uh, Yeah, Darth Vader's holding a candy cane Never seen that before, but that is freaking awesome. That is really cool. And also this. I have no idea. I think it might be a poster of some sort. It is a poster. Oh, no way. Okay, I know it's super bright. I apologize. Let's turn this down a little. It's a Call of Duty World War II poster. I actually ended up finding a whole bunch of these, like a ton of these. Not necessarily this one, but this style of actual like posters, I guess. I don't know, the ones with the stickers on the end. I found like a whole promotional display. If any of you remember that, let me know in the comments below because that was an awesome video. I ended up finding so many and here's another poster. That's freaking nuts. That is awesome. So far I got a poster. Got Christmas wrapping paper. I'm set for Christmas. Also a Tony Hawk skateboard. This thing is freaking awesome. Tony Hawk skateboard is lit. Let's get into this bag first because this bag right here oh ps4 game oh looks like a ps4 game this bag right here like i said is from the other game stop that uh i usually i usually don't go to this GameStop that often because it's further away from my house it's in a very sketchy neighborhood so i don't do it that often but uh i did so good last night that i was like you know what i have to i have to go back again tonight also everyone who wonders why i do so good with dumpster diving and like a lot of you try dumpster diving you don't find good stuff like i do the reason for that there's a very good reason for that and the main reason is that the GameStop i go to is in an insanely populated area like there's tons and tons of 
of people who go into that GameStop, let alone like just that GameStop, tons, I would say probably hundreds of people go in there a day. So there's lots and lots of people who, there's a lot of traffic. So there's a lot of people trading stuff in like this. This was most likely a trade in. There's tons of people in there all the time. So that's why I find as much as I do. And that's why there's a bag every night in the dumpster. Some GameStops, uh, if I go to other ones in like different like uh, uh, places and stuff, they won't have bags every single night because there's not enough people who go in the store and they don't throw out enough trash because of that reason. But uh, I just wanted to clear that up with everybody who is skeptical. I don't know why people would be, but I guess it makes sense. But uh, that's the thing I wanted to tell you guys. And let's just get into it. I've been talking too much. Let's rip into this bag. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we got here. Okay, apparently this was not a PS4 game. It is something else. Okay, we have a... Oh, it's a HyperX thing. It's a HyperX box. HyperX Cloud Stinger Core headset box. It's a brand new box that actually gets folded in. Well, it's a piece of cardboard, basically, that gets folded into a box. Pretty cool. <laughs> Not gonna keep it, though. That is bad to the bone. That just looks killer. Why? Oh, that looks... And it's only a GameStop? Oh, my God. That's actually really cool looking. It's called a Rig 500 Pro. I wonder how much money that goes for. That looks, that looks very, very expensive. I mean, they have like the gold decaling like all over it. There's even gold on the actual headset. That's dope. This is not promoted, by the way. <laughs> this is just a very cool looking headset. That is cool. Also, it's windy tonight. You guys know what that means. When it is windy, I don't know why, doesn't make sense, but when it's windy, I usually do very, very good dumpster diving, and yes, all this was found tonight so far. So we're doing good, baby. Let's continue through the bag. Also, if you're new, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you click that little bell notification because I am out here every day dumpster diving. On the weekends, I usually do an unboxing video, uh, the weekly recap of what I find throughout the week. So make sure you guys stay tuned. Make sure you do not miss a single video. I usually give away Pokemon cards. I apologize. I forgot them. <laughs> I forgot it in this video. But I will make sure I try to get them tomorrow for you guys. Let's continue through this. Da -da -da -da. Oh, oh, this bag's actually kind of heavy. It's heavier than I thought. Also, this is the bigger bag. I think that one wasn't that heavy. Sadly, nothing in it from that. Oh, but I guess we did so good last night that uh, there wasn't anything to be found this night. Either way, we're going to see what's in the giant bag. It just looks like a bunch of packaging material. I'm not expecting much, but I'm hoping there's a lot. I mean, all I can do is hope. Because seriously, it is 100% a mystery of what is in these bags. I always used to call these mystery bags, and I still do, for a reason. I call them mystery bags for a reason, guys. They're mysteries. So let's see what's inside. It seriously looks like just packaging material, but there's something red in here. Uh, weekly ad. Wow, that's a lot of sticker things from the Xbox games. <laughs> that's crazy. Wow, it's a whole ball. I think seriously, a ball. It's a ball of packaging material. <laughs> oh, that is hilarious. I don't know why I'm finding this funny, but that is, wow. Packaging material, killer. Let's see what else is in here. I'm seeing a Mickey D's cup. Oh yeah, Mickey D's. Wow, it's just like guts. I'm pulling out guts. It's like it's, uh, it's oh, it's just, it's weird. <laughs> it's just, it's super weird. Okay, oh, more guts, oh! No way! Oh my god, do you guys see that? That's a freaking controller. Oh yeah, baby, let's get this bad boy out of here. That's an Xbox 360 controller, oh my god. Oh, that, oh my god, it's actually one of the newer ones. No way. Okay, so before, this is actually really cool. This is one of the newer ones. It's the one that the D-pad can actually spin because it's chromed out and stuff. They didn't make all these chrome and they didn't make them so they could all spin. Somebody is on like a really loud motorcycle. Cool. Okay. <laughs> it's actually heavy too, so there has to be batteries in this. I'm guaranteeing this has acidy batteries. That's probably why it was thrown out. It's acidy bat. It definitely has batteries in it. I can feel it. It's heavy. Acidy batteries in three, two, one. Oh, it's a, oh no, what? I would have bet any amount of money. I'm, I'm like, I'm actually serious. I would have bet you guys at least a hundred dollars that this was acidy batteries. I'm lucky I didn't bet money on that. I would have lost, but this is a rechargeable battery pack. Oh, that is actually really cool. That's looking so clean. 
oh, that's a really, really good sign. But then maybe it's not a good sign. Maybe there's something wrong with the controller that it doesn't work. Most of the controllers, by the way, I find do actually work. A lot of the times the batteries are acidy. The controller, the thumbsticks are usually really bad. But uh, also with this controller, it has the newer thumbsticks. They don't have the little like uh, lines, like those like uh, those little dots that's up, like that makes a cross basically. These are like the newer ones that have like just a ring around them. That is, I don't. There has to be a button that's sticky. Oh, oh, huh? No, not really. The B button is a little sticky. That's usually what happens with these controllers. The B button gets sticky. I mean, maybe the controller just doesn't work for, for the most part though. When I find controllers, they usually work. It's, it's feeling solid, guys. Maybe the battery just died in the back and they didn't have an extra one to replace it with. So maybe they threw it out for that reason. I have no idea, but that is golden. Oh, tonight is amazing. Oh, this is such a freaking epic night. Oh my god, I got a skateboard. Got a freaking Xbox 360 controller. I got wrapping paper to wrap gifts up. Like, oh, you can't do better than wrapping paper. Like, that's one thing I've never found before is wrapping paper. So that's, <laughs> that's hilarious. Ooh, this is actually an Xbox One sticker, I believe. Like, it was like on the front where the disc tray is, or not disc tray, but disc insert part or something. I don't know, something like that. I think that's what it's from. Wow, this bag was actually really surprising. I didn't think there was going to be a controller in it. Usually package material bags are just packaging material. There's like food bags, packaging material bags, and then there's the good bags that are usually like really heavy. This bag wasn't that heavy. So go figure. Always got to go to the bottom of the bag. Because I find SD cards, I find DS games, I find money, I find everything. It's insane. And I think that is gonna be it for tonight, ladies and gentlemen. That is a heaping pile of trash. Oh yeah, but out of all this trash, there was all this. Well, actually just this. <laughs> this was with the stuff, just not in the bags. But either way, tonight was freaking golden. Oh my God, it is, finding this stuff is so worth going through this. It definitely is, 100%. Before I end this video, make sure you guys go check out my merchandise. My merch, it's Speedy Cat merch. Link in the description down below. It is kind of for a limited time. I'm not sure if I'm ever going to sell it again, so it might be very, very limited. Make sure you get it while you still can. It's only so many more days it's actually running online, so make sure you check it out. Make sure you follow my Twitter, Instagram, all that great stuff. And I'm gonna make a recap really quickly what was found. Like I said a thousand times this video, skateboard, controller, freaking wrapping paper, and a Call of Duty World War II poster. That's a freaking, that's a mega haul right there. That is a great, great night. Thank you all so much for watching. If you did like tonight's video, make sure you watch last night's video, the most recommended video over this aways. Woo! Also subscribe to the Speedy Gamer, my gaming channel. Haven't made a video in quite some time, I apologize, but make sure you check it out and subscribe to the Speedy Diver. Thank you all so much for watching, and when I do say thank you for watching. I truly mean it every single episode I say it. So thank you again and I will catch all of you amazing speedsters on the flip side.